Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. We talk a lot about self-love and taking mm -hmm. care of ourselves, especially as women of color. Our next guest says we should be equally protective of our mental health. Yes. Mm -hmm. Here to give us tips on maintaining a healthy mind, please welcome mental health advocate and author of Be Free, Be You, yes. uh, Akia Red. Yes. 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 I want to make sure I get that right. I didn't yes. want to say you got Akia. You got Akia. 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 So I'm gonna start it off. That's okay. Mm -hmm. we, we all know, as especially as African Americans, there's always a stigma when mental health is Absolutely. is concerned, mm -hmm. yes. and we all have that covered wagon kind of mentality. Mm -hmm. So how do you think that overall people of color fare with mental mm -hmm. health? Mm -hmm. That's a very good question. So it, the stat is actually really staggering. Mm -hmm. So according to the uh, National Alliance of Mental Illness, 20% um, mm -hmm. of all of Black people or African Americans are struggling and are less likely to receive treatment, mm -hmm. which again nods to and speaks to the stigma yeah. in the community. Right. Yeah, so. yeah. Well, I'm one of those people who's not afraid to talk about it, and I've been very transparent here yes. on Sister Circle. I'll see my therapist today at 12. Um, <laughs> I hope to see my therapist. How about that? <laughs> yeah, I love the couches. The couches are the best. Yes. Um, what, what are we afraid of? What are we afraid of when it comes to seeking help? Are we afraid of what we'll find? Is that what it is? Or what are I your mean, thoughts on it? I mean, I think partially we're afraid of what we'll find, but I think that we're afraid to look weak. Mm. Okay, I mean, you know, if you think about it, we can go all the way back to, you know, back in the day, mm -hmm. we were taught to be strong, especially mm -hmm. as African American women. Yes. Right? We don't we don't let our emotions show. We ride or die, we hold it in, mm -hmm. and we don't ask for help. So that's what we're afraid of. Yes. We don't want to appear too vulnerable. Man. Wow. Yeah, it took me a while to get there. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Oh, 100%, mm -hmm. yeah. definitely. Yeah. You know, it's been a journey. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. Well, Akia, you are a PK's kid. Ooh. And you, Ooh. just like Trina. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and I'm sure the both of you, you, you were taught to kind of sweep things under the rug, you know, mm -hmm. kind of pray things away. You mm -hmm. know, we don't talk about it. It's just quiet. Yeah. We just forget and keep going. Yes. What do you say to people who give that advice? And what type of, and do you think that it's, it's good advice? And what type of things that you face? Well, first of all, I'm gonna tell the audience, don't believe it. Okay, right. yeah, don't believe okay, that, then. you know, mm -hmm. because um, praying it away, you know, how's that working out for you? Mm -hmm. Is what I like to say to people. And it doesn't mean that you have any less faith. Mm -hmm. I'm a woman of faith myself. Yes. Um, and I stand by my faith in God, however, comma. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that's Trina. You were Trina. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, I believe that some folk need prayer and a prescription. Hello, yes. somebody. Okay? Mm -hmm. And I'm one of those people. And it's okay to, you know, go and seek help and, and, and also pray about it. Mm -hmm. So, hey, okay. that's in what I say. In addition to. In yeah. addition <laughs> to. Honey. In yeah. addition to. Don't forget that comma. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> Speaking of what, I feel like the Lord has given you the therapist to go to. Yes. Oh, absolutely. Just like a doctor, it's yes. the same thing. If you if you get stabbed, you're just gonna be like, I'm gonna pray. Well, right. Uh, I'm gonna right. pray that the blood right. don't just. Right. I feel Silly. you, girl. Now, what <laughs> happens when? What happens when? What are some of the things that we as, you know, what we can all look for mm -hmm. in people who actually don't get help and they're dealing with these things, they're mm -hmm. dealing with depression right. and trauma and things of that nature. Maybe they don't know that they're dealing with it. Mm -hmm. What are some of the things that we can look for and what, ha because what happens to a person when they don't mm -hmm. get the help? Well, speaking from my experience, um, I cried nonstop. Mm -hmm. um, everything made me cry, you know, happy, sad. I just had the same emotion, same mm -hmm. gear. Um, I developed tremoring, um, just extremely nervous about everything, living too much in the future, mm. um, forecasting what mm -hmm. we think is going to happen, mm -hmm. or that. living a little bit too far in the past. That mm -hmm. is depression, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you know. So um, I think just really being very keyed in on how they're behaving, how they're, you know, conducting themselves on a daily basis, withdrawing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now, what if it's your spouse? Um, well, wow. how do you talk to? you know, your spouse. Well, you know what, be free, be you, right? That's mm -hmm. the book, you just gotta, you just gotta just let them know and let it out and, and tell them because otherwise, if we're not being open with our spouses or with people about our struggle, 
we're going to find ourselves depressed. We're mm -hmm. going to find ourselves more anxious. Mm -hmm. And they love you. Yeah. And they want you to get help. And it's yeah. going to make you a better spouse to them mm -hmm. if you're getting the help that you need. Oh, right. That's it. Ooh. Yeah. I'm much better now. I mean, oh. I mean but listen. <laughs> what, is that, what does that flight attendant say? What? Secure yes. your oxygen yes. mask right. before yes. you help yes. somebody yes. else. Right? So yes. we've got to help ourselves first. Right. Before yes. 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 And, and your husband's a former NBA player. He is. And I know that, you know, my husband's a former NBA mm -hmm. player as well. Yeah. So I know they go through a, a traumatic moment after they stop playing. 100%. How did you get through his retirement? Mm. Oh, with, 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 uh, with love. Girl. And, and, uh, patience. and patience. And patience. And, 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 and grace. Somebody <laughs> said, somebody to shout it right yes. there. Yeah. They just did. They just did. <laughs> Absolutely. But, you know, again, it has been a journey. And I think we've been, we've been growing together. Mm -hmm. yeah. and he's been with mm -hmm. me and very supportive. And I've actually helped him a little bit. Yes. 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 That's awesome. Well, I have this twofold thing. So I'm going to piggyback on Selena for just one second. Because I do, I do want to find out how we can... Uh, uh, learn to self-love and yeah. to be more self-confident. Mm -hmm. But what do you say to that friend who always connects mental health with a negative connotation? Say, oh, maybe you should go and talk to somebody, and they automatically like, well, I don't need to talk to nobody. One hundred and ten percent. You know what? You know, yeah. <laughs> it's so true. Yeah. It's so true. One hundred percent. Well, I mean, I honestly, okay, so, you know, we've all heard the adage, curiosity killed the cat. Uh -huh. In this case, curiosity does not kill the cat, mm -hmm. okay? So be curious. Yes. Ask them questions, okay? And, and remember that, you know, they, they don't want to feel this way. Mm -hmm. So they just, they don't want to be fixed either. They yes. want to be seen and they want to be heard. Yes. So just come to them with that mentality and that approach of, I just, I see you and I That's hear good. you. That's yeah. good. That's good. Absolutely. Good. Absolutely. Good. So um, I know you had a couple of tips on yes. what African Americans can do to improve our self-love and self-confidence. What are they? Well, well I was tip number one. Well, yes. <laughs> well, we need to love ourselves, okay? Yes. Enough to accept our flaws and our imperfections. Yes. I mean, that's what the book Be Free, Be You is all about. I, I learned to love and accept my diagnosis of mm -hmm. having an anxiety disorder. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. you know, yes, it's important to get us to the next place. Mm -hmm. Yes, Lord, mm -hmm. yes. Mm -hmm. You also say that we have to know that we are worthy of love. How do we do that? Well, you know what? As a woman of faith, I'll have to say that I know before anything else, I'm God's daughter. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. So regardless of what your relationship with your natural parents may be, you have a heavenly father. And mm -hmm. that is what I believe in. Mm -hmm. So that's how I know I'm worthy of love. Mm -hmm. Right. Right. Mm -hmm. Right. Tip mm -hmm. number two, you say love yourself enough to trust that you are worthy and deserving of love time and attention. Yes, ma'am. Well, again, that oxygen mask scenario, mm -hmm. okay? So when I'm giving myself that time to be myself and hang out with myself and date myself, mm -hmm. if you will, meaning alone time, solitude is good. Mm -hmm. Right. Oh, yeah. it sure is. Oh, huh? yeah. <laughs> it's, 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 it's so peaceful. I have a good time. You ain't got to worry about nobody but yourself. You ain't got to entertain nobody but yourself. But right, yourself. right, yes. And last but not least, seek out resources and experiment with treatments to find out what works for you. Some yes. people just need to be, mm -hmm. you know, to have counsel. Some people need counseling and medicine. Right. <laughs> exactly. Right. But, but, but you have to do the work. You have to do out. the work. You yes. have to do the work and explore. Yes, absolutely. Yes. Well, before we go, I, I want to know, well, we all want to know about your organization, mm -hmm. Real Girls, um, They Fart. Yes. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Tell us about that. Like, how so, do we fart? So we, we, <laughs> well, first and foremost, we fart by finding our voices and letting it out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I really didn't mean to be clever. It just turned out that <laughs> way, right? <laughs> but um, fearless, authentic, rescuer, and trailblazer. Yes. 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 So awesome. Awesome. Adapt that for our lives. Like thank you so much. Thank you for much. having for me. Absolutely. Absolutely. And such so great advice for today. For more tips like yes, this, you can follow you. her on the gram at Real Girls.